today we're in Woolwich and we is me, hello I'm Jeff and this is Daniela. Hi! <laughs> We've come to Woolwich for a very specific reason. Daniela recently joined us here at Londonist and in her first week one of the things we made her do was go down the Rotherhithe Tunnel and walk through it because she didn't know that you could walk through the Rotherhithe Tunnel. And today's task came about because when she came back there was a conversation in the office about what other tunnels you could do in London and somebody suggested doing the Woolwich Tunnel and I went don't you mean the Woolwich Ferry? And they went, no, the Woolwich Tunnel. I didn't know there was a tunnel. And Daniela said, I didn't know there was a ferry. <laughs> You've come here today to do both. Right, so Dan, you're gonna go and take the ferry. Yes. And I'm gonna go and take the tunnel. And we're gonna see who wins, right? And we're gonna time ourselves. And we got two cameras, so this is gonna be very confusing. Starting stopwatches in three, two, one. See you on the other side. See you on the other side. <laughs> So to actually get to the foot tunnel, you have to enter it through this building here. There was a very tiny sign, a small sign, back out on the street that went foot tunnel this way. I don't think it was very well signposted. Let's do it. All the cars and trucks are being loaded on and hopefully we're one of the people that makes it there too. <laughs> Where are the steps? Ah, the steps around the back. <gasps> Here we go. Gates have just lifted and we are walking, well, making our way onto the ferry. It says passengers are advised to remain seated until the vessel has burst. We're gonna follow that. It's too fun walking around everywhere. 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50. 101, 101 steps. It's a tunnel. <laughs> oh, nice. It's just that it feels like everybody knows about the Greenwich Foot Tunnel, but the Woolwich Foot Tunnel is its poorer neighbour that not as many people know about. And I've never done this. I haven't lived in London for the majority of my life, born in London. Why have I never made it out to Woolwich and walked to the Woolwich Foot Tunnel? We are just about to pull in to the other side. Uh, I'm pretty sure Jeff has made it. But to be fair, we did have to wait for the, another ferry to come towards us. Wow, it's a sunny day. We are just about to pull into the other side. It's 126 steps and I can see the ferry pulling in over there. Just have to go and find her. We made it to the other side. Yeah, I've I've been here I've been here quite a while. <laughs> in in all fairness, yeah. we did miss the ferry. So you got the second one? Yeah, we had to end up getting the second one. Just just for completeness, you're now going to get the foot tunnel back. Yeah. And I'm going to get the ferry over. Okay. Shall I see where we first started? Yeah. Go. Let's do it. <laughs> So I'm walking back round to where I first went into the foot tunnel. And <laughs> time and, is so rolling. And we have any other so what would you think would be the fair summary? For fresh air, take the ferry. Um, to be in control of your journey and not have to worry for timings, yes. take take the foot tunnel. I would say if you've just missed one, take the foot tunnel. Yeah. It will be quicker. If as you turn up you can see it's going to leave in the next minute or two then the ferry is obviously quicker. To be honest if this was my daily commute I think I'd take the tunnel one way and then take, take, the, the, boat, take, the, boat, take the boat back. What other tunnels can we send you down? <laughs> <laughs> 